Hi there, my name is Nightwalker. I'm going to review on an Android 7-inch tablet called Anor Noble 7 Paladin. Actually, there's a two model for this one. $100 model, which is $99 model, is Anor Noble 7 Basic, and $75 model called Anor Noble 7 Paladin. I got this one uh, probably three days ago, and I'm trying to review some of the application and the whole like whole thing. And this one, Anor Noble 7 Paladin is first Android 4.0 tablet and it is based on MIPS processor. So, well, uh, this is not the first MIPS, MIPS processor Android tablet. There's uh, some MIPS process Android tablet like I don't know I believe it's a 4.3 PMP also there's a Freescale Android PMP was released last year called Longi A3 but this one is like 32 is more like uh, Cortex A8 CPU model and it has 512 Mac RAM not the DDR3 but DDR2 and 8 gig NAND and also, it's 800 by 480 resolution, and as you see, 7 inches. So, just look at it. This, uh, I just want to just show up like the home menu, home UI, and like this. Okay, so like this, like this, and go to widget, and go to home menu, uh, go. Okay, so, so I just so everybody just already saw the home and application so I just go to setting okay uh, okay go to setting okay setting okay there's a uh, lots of setting I already activate Wi-Fi and the data usage and sound display also this this one has vibrate function so when you start it shake it it shakes and also about the, uh one about well, one gig total space for the application battery four thousand and what else and for the languages you can choose English for sure so English is to United Kingdom and United States and you can choose like German Spanish, Ita Italian, and French, and I don't know, it's Arabic, I believe, and then Chinese, so, but that's it. I believe it's, you can only choose 11 languages, so you cannot choose Russian, Japanese, Thai, Korean, or Portuguese, something like that, or Thai, Hindi, Bengal, no. So you can choose only 11 languages, so if you're outside this, if you bought this, but you, you cannot choose this kind of languages, you have to download more locale to set it up. And also, let's see about this device, about this tablet is uh, 4.01, and build number is 4.01. Was built in 2011, December 21st. Actually, uh, some of the tablet uh, claim to go to 400. Uh, Android 4.0 used Android version 4.3, not 4.1, so it's not pretty new. Okay, so let's say, let's go. And well, there's a uh, there's a lot of application down there, but major problem for this tablet is about uh its market. Okay, so market works for sure. So kind of lagging because I don't think my Wi-Fi does work really fine. Okay, so so you can see the normal Android market. It's an English market, so but so problem is try to download some application like Firefox or like Dolphin or like Opera. You cannot download any. So I just go for Firefox. Okay, market search. No. No Firefox or mobile. No. 
Okay. Opera. Okay. Nope. There, there's only opera notes. The fanciness of opera. Pretty funny, but opera notes full. So this is totally different from the web browser. So you cannot download any web browser. You can only download. You can only download nothing, I believe. So you have to use a stock web browser. There's two of them. One is actually where is it? Stock Google browser. Works fine. Okay. So go to ESPN. Yes. Okay. ESPN Home. Well, it's working fine, but so yeah. When you go there, it has a bit of lagging. So <sighs> compared with the Home UI, it's a little bit slow for scrolling. And what else? Okay, YouTube, uh, well, YouTube, okay, go, so, go to YouTube, for this is a fresh 10.3 basis, so, let's see, no, so, I don't know, go, problem is, fresh does not work. See? It's not working perfectly. See? It's only sh like, you can only hear the music. And also, it's crack out. So, uh, okay, turn it on. Turn it on. Okay? So, you see? It's totally. Done already, so what should I have to do? Reset. Okay, there's a reset button right there. Oh, damn it. Oh. Okay. So. Okay, reset it. Yeah, now it's turning on again. So. So. If you want to use a fresh, like, web-based fresh video, doesn't work. <laughs> yeah, doesn't work. So I have to return it on and reset everything. You know, it's a pretty stupid, but you have to do it. So, for web browser, this one is pretty limited. And you cannot use, like, various web browser and even your stock web browser is pretty limited. So you just go web browsing and that's it. Uh, and there's one more I will show you like 20 seconds later and there's a sky browser from China is yes, it it does not support any flash but due to that it's fast but it's not good <laughs> okay so this is a sky browser yeah and problem is problem is this browser you can uh the it's uh access is pretty limited. Okay, so go for ESPN. Okay, ESPN dot com. Okay, this one does work, but okay, ESPN dot com seems to be uh well go uh nope not working. Okay, then go to Google. Okay, google.ca, okay, is it working? Nope, I don't know which which website going to work, uh, okay, this is ANOR, which is their website, uh, dot com, okay, okay, ANOR? Well, it does not work. I don't know why, but well, <laughs> the web browser is pretty fucked up. So <laughs> uh, I cannot test with this one for sure. And 
I showed this web browser and the problem is another problem is the file explorer. Okay. Not file explorer. Uh, it works fine. ES like ES ES file uh, file explorer or Astro file explorer works fine. But uh, the one I want to show you that uh, you cannot uh, install AK APK like application from outside. So I I actually uh, saved some of the APK from my computer and so I want to test one. Okay, game to the games. Okay, baseball superstar. Okay, install. Nope, application not installed. That's the message you will always see. Like, I think I test like hundred application. I think it's twenty or like a twenty or thirty percent is working, and then seventy to eighty percent is probably not working. So it's showing every time I try to install in, install application from my side and save it to SD card doesn't work. So and that's it. And what else? And and so movie uh, and movie player also you cannot install Pyro Meridian MX. Also, M video player because you cannot get it from Android Market, and I uh, was trying to install from the web outside, which is I saved to SD card, and by using APK installer doesn't work. So only Soul Player and Media Player is which is a stock uh, stock media player from the company, and it's more like this, but the uh, it does not have any subtitle function, so I go for the Soul Movie Player, and I test a certain different code, uh, video codec, and ten works, and three of them not works, uh, and also uh, here's the original one. This is a 1080p. It's working. Okay, it's working. Okay, so. I will show you the non-working codec. It's a CUDA H264. See? See? Not working. Okay, I trust. I tried to shut it off. Part. Test killer and let's see, this one doesn't work. And direct stream, which is direct stream from the original video. Okay, this video cannot be played. Please contact contact your phone maker. It doesn't want to work. Okay, another one is which one is it? Right there, Microsoft MPEG4 version three. Uh, no, not version three. It's a version two. Uh, Okay, no, not working. So it works with some of the codec, video codec, but some of them does not work. So you have to be careful with the encoding some of them, some of the movie. But if they claim to be like non-encoding video player for this one, so it's not really good. And also, I'll try to download uh, some of them, some of them. Uh, like music player, well, there's a, uh, there's Android Market has own music player, so it shows like uh, several MP3 or AG or no OGG or uh, like FLB kind of file. It works, and it also uh, it can also access access SD card. Oh well, I'll I'll tell you later. But some of the pro uh, some of the application for this machine cannot access the SD card directly. So this one can access SD card directly, so it's good. Uh, let's see, for this one, so, well, I was trying to access it, nope, it's not working. Try to stick it, nope, not working. So, this is what, what happened to most of uh, your music player. So, another one uh, for a quadruple score, 
Let's go for a score. So, for benchmark. This one, actually, uh, based on the GZ4770 CPU from Inzenic. Uh, it's, uh, I already mentioned previously, it's a 32 MIPS processor. It's a different from ARM processor, which is mostly used from other Android tablet. And 512 is the DDR RAM. And it, uh, I forgot to mention that this is Vivante G C A60 is a successor for Vivante G C A100. It's a better GPU, so graphic uh, processing unit. Uh, it is better, <laughs> actually. So when you're using the Vivante G C uh, G C A100, what happens is this one does not show like colorfully. This only shows like black and white grayscale. So this one you can actually see the it's moving with a full scale. But I know uh I will I actually te uh learned uh, I actually tested before I do the disc review, see? The your device is only nine oh seven. It's uh, just better than Samsung Galaxy S. Hmm. But you know the most of the most of the tablet which leaves this year like not this year the after not this year, last year September, the quadrant score is about even the the Android two point three is about between fifteen hundred to two thousand. So this one, at least end of last year, is only quadrant score is nine oh seven. I know some people argue that uh, quadrant score does not impact actual specs of this machine, but no, this one is pretty horrible. I mean, okay. And another another one, okay. What should I have? Go for it. Uh, yeah. Book reader. Yeah, it's working fine. I mean, I tested several of them, but it's most of the. Yeah, most of the. Uh, evil, evil reader works fine, except. This one, this one has a, uh, some kind of box. Uh, actually, when I tap it right there, it has to show some like page scrolling animation. But this one just normal, just nothing. So this one has like, well, it's working, but has a problem on it. And other one, like which one is it? Okay, and I reader. Yeah, it's working. It's also called debug. Okay, it works. Yeah, it's working. And I tried to download our deco reader, which is better reader. I like one, that one, because I, it's good. There, our deco reader can can display various format, ebook e format. So I like it, but problem is you cannot download from the Android market also. And what else? And games, okay. Well, most I told you I tried to download like hundred application at the same time, but only twenty or thirty percent application works. And this one, well, I, some of them even you install inside the machine, it does not work for like this Epic Astro Story. Unfortunately, Epic Astro Story has stopped, and problem is it messed up everything. See. I didn't even open that web browser. Chinese web browser is working. Working. No. No. Exit. Like. What the. F yeah. Like. I don't even like to do it this, but it's messing up everything. Launcher. Okay. I don't know why, but. You show up. Everything. And like. Model Sky. I downloaded it second version and for this one work first version is Chinese version it work it's a stock one and there's HD version like Spider-Man, Wildfish, Last Defender, Turbo Fry, 3D all works uh, I o well I only show the Spider-Man then uh, problem is uh, I was trying to download the game while program doesn't work so I have to go to directly to website to buy it and problem is I don't like it because I'm not sure it's going to be compatible for this machine or not. But 
this one, uh, for that reason, Game Walk actually just, uh, give you the icon that directly access Game Walk, which is Game Walk game, game, which is compatible to this one. Okay, I don't like Spider-Man whole, okay, so, for Spider-Man works, that's what they claim the best game for this one, so continue, okay, loading, okay, it works, so, what can I say, it works. Yeah, it works, it's a dual touch, so it works, anyway, main menu, yes, okay, turn it off, okay, I turn it off, yes, okay, and Comic Viewer, hmm, oh well, go for home, where I should do Comic Viewer, uh, where is it, uh, I only, oh yeah, there's only one Comic Viewer right there, I tried to sub a Comic Viewer already, and, well, okay, only one of them works, which is this one, ACV, <laughs> okay, so, I tried to download like J Comic Viewer, Perfect Viewer, or I forgot one more one more viewer, but uh, does not work. So only HGV works. So if you want to watch, uh, like read comics, just download HGV. And uh, that that one top HD game. This is actually direct access to Game Loft website. So this one is. Probably, I, I believe they selling games that are compatible for this machine, like game software, like two games are valuable for the for your Ano Noble Seven Paladin. So I think it's uh, most of the game does not compatible for this one. Only two games compatible for Ano Noble Seven. So okay, so go there and what else? And Google application search. You cannot download Google search, and you cannot you cannot use the voice searching, and also only and which one is it? Map does work. Well, it does work. Anyway, it does work. And but you cannot download YouTube. I will show you the the whole thing. So. Go to YouTube. Okay. Oh, what the? You. Okay. You. Two. Okay. Okay. No. There's no YouTube application, so you cannot download YouTube or you cannot watch YouTube. And if you want to watch YouTube by web, it doesn't work. So, forget it. <laughs> okay. So, and launcher. Mostly. Well. Mostly when even the 2.3, like ginger using gingerbread or 2.2 Florio or like 3.0 honeycomb or 4.0 uh, ice cream, when using a launcher like ADW launcher, launcher pro or home plus home plus plus launcher or call launcher, you can make whole thing. But this one, you can only you you can only download two of them, which is well, I try to, well, not all, two of them, but if you look for the market, there should be many of, uh, many of launcher out there, but only the launcher pro works. Okay, does work. Mm. It works better for scoring, and then another one, okay. <sighs> okay, go launcher. Hmm. It works. It works fine, actually. Got it. Okay, go. Okay. It works fine. So you can use it if you want. Uh, okay, launcher. So I think this is it. Uh, I didn't show the some of some of the thing. Uh, some of the thing which is access to PC for this one. Well, most of the Android tablet, uh, when you connect to connect to the PC, 
the top way work as external fresh memory for some reason, but this one, no. It does not work as the external memory, it does not recognize SD card when you connect with connect to the PC. Also for format support. Uh when you go to for uh, when you if you want to download firmware for this one, go you have to go to www.anor.com and problem is yes, you can download firmware for basic and Paladin. The problem is I don't think they can they can support lots of firmware for like next this year. The reason why I'm saying that because they last year 2000, 2012 they released ten different smart device and four of them does not have any firmware even they have they have Android OS like I believe Anor HD uh, uh, Anor V5000 HDR and Anor Nova 3 uh, based on Android OS doesn't uh, and doesn't have a stock firmware so you cannot download firmware, no upgrade, no firmware, okay, firmware support whatsoever. So, no. Uh, final verdict. Well, if if you just want to throw away seventy five dollar, you can use, you can buy this. But for me, I'm not going to buy it because there's a lot of seventy five dollar <laughs> Android tablet. Like, uh, which one is it? It's a UN Dow N twelve. The same 7 inch tablet, it's a 5 touch. This one only 2 touch or dual touch. And another one is Cube U9 GT or Cube K8 GT or Telcast T760 or on the VX610W. A lot of them. They're better. Actually, they're really better. This one? No. So. This one, I don't think it's not, it's not even worth seventy five dollars. It's only worth like thirty or forty dollars. It's not even better than Ecan M009s. So beware, don't buy it.